Hi everyone. I'd like to talk a bit more about gauge pins because I left out a couple of things in my previous video in an effort to simplify things. But I really should have covered the fact that there are metric sets of gauge pins, of course, and those are sold in various sets as well, spaced uh, 0.02 millimeters apart, which is roughly about the same spacing. It's actually about eight tenths of a thousandth. It was also pointed out to me by a Reddit user named Thrustin Limbersnake that I didn't talk about the different classes of gauge pin fit. And they have a lot of different ones. Uh, the ones I was talking about in the first video are what are called Class ZZ pins. Now these have a .0002 or 2 tenths tolerance in the inch size pins and it's .005 or 5 thousandths of a millimeter in the metric size pins. Then it goes to class Z which is one tenth on the inch pins and .0025 or two and a half thousandths of a millimeter on the metric pins. From there we go to the class Y pins which has a tolerance of 70 millionths on the inch sizes and .0018 on the metric sizes. Then you've got the really tight ones. You have class X, which is 40 millionths of an inch on the inch pins or a thousandth of a millimeter on the metric pins. And then class XX, or double X, however they want to say it, um, that's 20 millionths of an inch plus or minus on the inch size and uh, five ten thousandths of a millimeter on the metric size. So which class you use depends entirely on the kind of work that you do. If you're doing just general shop work, or if you're a home shop that doesn't need a whole lot of precision, class ZZ is totally fine. If you're doing a lot of precision grinding and gauge work and inspection work, you might want to get some of the higher grade ones. Hopefully this clears up any questions that people might have had from the first video. And once again, I'd like to give a shout out to Mr. Thrust and Limber Snake over there on Reddit. I can only assume that that is Justin Timberlake trying to disguise himself on the internet. So listen, man, I can't wait for your next album. I'm sure it's going to be great. Have your people call my people. We can do lunch. I've got some song ideas. Also, if you're a machinist who's looking for a place on the internet to hang out with a bunch of like-minded folks, Check out the Machinist subreddit over there at uh, reddit.com slash r slash machinists. Everyone likes to see project pictures and pictures of nasty coolant tanks and stuff like that. It's a blast. Hopefully I'll see you there. Until then, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.